kick-started a conversation for many to share their history. Organizers behind the group Conversation Starters are hoping to build relationships by leading a discussion on what it means to be Creole. There's no set starting point for how Creoles were first identified and how um, they were first founded. So we allow people to self-identify and then to explain why or how they self-identify, whether that's family history, whether it's something they read in a historical document. The event also bringing two cousins who recently found out they were related together for the first time. So we just found each other. He found me rather on Facebook through a mutual friend that we had and it's just a happy accident. But that's, that's the kind of thing in this area. You might be cousins with the person that you're passing in the grocery store and not know it. And both sharing stories of their Creole family roots. I like talking about my family and my family history and to, to be able to share it with other people who have similar sort of experiences. Uh, it's quite beautiful. Those participating in the conversation are hoping it will show people they have more similarities than differences. We have a shared history in Acadiana and um, I would like everyone to embrace that. Not, not because I think it's important, but I think it's important to the population for us to understand each other. And I think it'll bridge a lot of gaps. In Lafayette, Jordan Lippincott, KTC TV3.